Time to try a little Malaysian food in Queens. Hello. Uh, for what? This is good. Thanks. Do you have a do you have a Indonesian dishes as well or Malaysian only? Malaysia. Okay. Malaysia. Perfect. I I uh, order pickup. Like, you order already? Yes, I ordered. All right, let's see what we got here. So of course the laksa, the mee siam. Let's see what I've not seen before. Clams and black bean sauce. Let's check out some house specialties. Curry asam fish head. Sounds good. Uh, marmite shrimps. Malaysian special marmite sauce. Never heard of that. Soups. Fish head soup. Seafood tom yum. <coughs> Hmm. Oh, here we go. Maybe we'll try one of these laksas. So curry noodle with stuffed bean curd, curry shrimp noodle, curry beef tripe. That sounds kind of fun. Hokkien udang mi, ipor hor fun. Never tried this. Fish head mi hoon. What's this one? Eggplant with belacan. That's the Malaysian shrimp paste. Or Kakang Pendek Belakan. So all these are with the shrimp paste. That sounds good. Yum. What is that dish? That's the fish head curry? Yeah. Okay. I think I'm looking at this Hokkien Udang Mi. Looks most exciting. Is this... Is that one the uh, Ban Mi Hakka noodle? No. No? It's 83. 83. Curry noodle with stuffed bean curd. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to try the uh, Hokkien Udang. Me? Okay. Is there anything else you recommend? In terms of stir fried noodles, in terms of appetizers? Or Just what you're most known for here. No vegetable, one one six. Char, okay. Yes. Maybe that's too much food. Is there a, a, like a small, what, is there anything you. Skewers, satay number eight. Yeah. What would you eat with this? With the Hokkien Mi? Eat by itself. Yeah, it's a, by itself? Already, yeah. Do you dip? Do you dip anything no, in it? No. That's a noodle soup. Okay, I'll do that. Perfect. Satay. I know satay. Just the noodle soup. Just, uh, Thank you. Okay. Let's <laughs> eat. Oh, that's nice. I'm excited for the soup. It looks like it has a ton of stuff in it. <laughs> My guy over there went fish head curry. Gotta try that next. The fish head and broth. Looks like a clear soup with I think some watercress or something in there and a fish head. Good order. It's nice I can track the markets as I have my Malaysian lunch. Sir. Sir. So this uh this is fish cake? Pork, egg, pork, egg, noodles. and egg. Okay, and then do I add uh, any? Do you have any spicy like chili? Yes. You can, can bring. You take it. Try it first. This is already spicy. Okay. Yes. Try. It. Okay. The challenge. What is this? Sambal? This is sambal. Just hot sauce. Hot sauce. Okay. Sweet. All right. Let's try it. Very spicy though. It's spicy. I'm into that. Put the chopstick. Taste it before you put it. in. <laughs> it's not that spicy. No, that's the sauce. Oh, the sauce is spicy. Yeah. Okay, tastes good. Really nice. You can taste the shrimp paste in it. And that broth has so much flavor. Whoa. This would be like the perfect hangover meal. All right, let's see what we got here. A little fish cake. That's good. Oh, I dip. I should dip that, huh? Yeah. Let's do that. It's fine. Come on. 
You don't believe me. He doesn't believe me. It's chili like eating uh, nothing. Yeah. Well, no, it's good, eating. man. It's good. It's good. Okay, let's try noodles. That was a really good springy, fresh, yum. Get there for the leg. This thing's loaded. Shrimp. This is one of the best soups I think I've had in New York. Honestly, there's so much stuff in this thing. Some green beans over here. So what can you find next? What's the best way to eat this? You take maybe a little broth, I think. And some noodle like that. Is that the technique? Tell me. This is a fish curry or fish no, 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 soup. No curry. No curry. Fish head. And what is this called? This is called bell curry? I asked him. I'm gonna ask this guy. What is, what is this called? Belican? Cool. I'm trying to figure out what this spinach is. I think it's water spinach. This is just like a pickled jalapeno? Yes. It's good. Spicy? Sometimes. What's good? It's good. No, I got this. I got double. <laughs> good to the last drop. There you go. You guys have a good lunch? Good lunch? Yeah, nice. What should I get next time? Yeah. What should I order next time? Uh, this? Yeah, which dish, which is a good dish to try next time? What? You want to know which one next? Yeah, what, what should I order next? Which one? Hello? Oh, next we will talk when we meet. Okay, what you want? Look at all these dishes. Sizzling bean curd, banh mi haka noodle. Tahu imas, that sounds cool. <coughs> Thank you. All right. What a great spot. Tastes good. Malaysia, right across from the basketball court. The ballers playing. Love it. Let's go into this Malaysian, Asian grocery store and see what we can find. I want to find some of that shrimp paste. Okay, there's a little fish head curry paste. That's Indonesia. All right. Thai fruit. This looks like Filipino. Bagung Alamang, that's Filipino. Still looking for Malaysians. What's this? This looks like a shrimp paste. This looks like, yeah, Thailand. Okay, we keep looking for some Malaysian products. Okay, I've heard rumors, top line. Supermarket has Malaysian food and Indonesian food. So let's see if top line can deliver because I'm blanking out so far. Ooh, this looks good. Endless. Here we go, back to, what is this? Manufactured in the Philippines. This looks much more promising though. Product of Thailand. Wow, this is a wild amount of stuff. Ketchai and brine, I don't know what that is. Where's this from? Maybe Thai. We will find something. What is this? Pickled green mango? That just looks amazing. Bangkok, that would be so good in salads. Still on the hunt. This is all Halo Halo stuff. So this is 
Macapuna. We know that from Philippines. Let's try this aisle, which I haven't gone down. Here we go. Perfect. So this is what I'm talking about. Fermented seasoning sauce. This looks like, yeah, product of Malaysia. Perfect. This is a great one. This is a great sauce. Product of Malaysia. What else we got here? All the... Here we go, the sambals. This is what I'm looking for, shrimp sambal. Hainese rice mix. This is the crispy anchovy chili. Wow. Looks good. Milaka palm syrup. And of course, coffee. And these new, you have all the noodles too. Oh, awesome. Perfect. Okay, well, I'm going to grab this one for the road. And I might grab one of these. But that's it. We did it. We found some Malaysian groceries. We found our delicious bowl of soup that we had. And we're going to roll forward. Look at all these fish. Look at this. This is cool too. Singlong Gula Malaka. I think this is like a raw sugar. Yum. What's this? Istimiwa Biju. I don't know what that is. Well, I'm going to grab one of these for the rope. What else? <clears throat> Down here, you got the turmeric powder, of course. The baba fish curry powder, that looks awesome. And this kaya coconut spread, which is I think a, it's kind of like a Malaysian jam. I think I'm gonna, that's from Singapore. <sighs> Singapore curry gravy. Okay, we got a special surprise. Durian King biscuit, this guy told me. That place is amazing. Okay, so let's go try a biscuit. He told me you're supposed to microwave these. Uh, but some people just eat them at room temperature, so I'll try one at room temperature and you guys tell me if I'm supposed to microwave them, if anyone's ever had them, but they are from Malaysia. Okay, let's see who we're working with. I can already smell the durian. Okay, let's open this up. Oh yeah. There's a little durian action in that. This is kind of cool. It's like a flaky pastry vibe. Whoa, that is durian. That's delicious. It's kind of like a gummy, very flaky. It's kind of like a gummy center. Wow. No joke, that is so good. I'm really glad I bought that. I wasn't gonna buy it because I was just like, do people even eat these? And the guy's like, somebody works here, you have to try it. This is delicious, not as strong as I thought it was with the durian flavor. When I first smelt it, I was like, like when you open the bag, it's really powerful, but this is delicious. So that is a successful ending to a little Malaysian food tour. We had a great bowl of soup for lunch. We looked around, we checked out some groceries. Okay, I actually took this home and threw it in the oven for five, four minutes and heated it up, like it said. Uh, I don't have a microwave, so I threw down oven. So let's see if we can get it to mimic that droopy goodness, okay? So here's what it looks like, let's see. <laughs> That's better. See, we got that droopiness happening. Let's see. Oh yeah. That's a totally different product. That's like a warm jam filled strudel now with a little durian hint. That is the way to eat it. Room temp is fine, but you heat that thing up, 
becomes a whole nother beast. So that's it. That was a great little trip. Eat some Malaysian food. Have a good one until next time.